briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1994, the Missouri Court of Appeals heard the case of Branco Enterprises, Inc. v. Delta Roofing, Inc., which revolved around the doctrine of promissory estoppel. This legal principle holds that a contract can be formed and enforced if one party makes a promise that another party reasonably relies on, even in the absence of a formal offer and acceptance. The case arose when Branco Enterprises embarked on a project to renovate a consumer's market building in Neosho, Missouri. They sought a subcontractor to install a new roof and accepted Delta Roofing's bid of $21,545, which was considerably lower than competing bids and included a $1,200 warranty. Delta stated that it was seeking approval for an alternative roofing material or Owens Corning certification as required by the project's architectural specifications. The court found that Branco had relied on Delta's bid, which constituted a legally binding contract. However, Delta later refused to install the roof at the agreed-upon price and demanded more money instead. Consequently, a lower court awarded Branco damages of $18,695. Delta appealed this decision but ultimately lost the case. The Missouri Court of Appeals held that a valid oral contract existed between Branco and Delta, which Delta had breached by failing to perform at the bid price. The court ruled that Branco was justified in relying on Delta's promise and ordered Delta to reimburse Branco for the additional expenses incurred due to their non-performance. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.